bad. Yeah, cheese makes people mad, but it really it really shouldn't. Makes me mad too. Alright, so um me and what do you want to do now? Just questions or uh it's up to you. Another easy person? <laughs> Another easy person, so I gotta find like a bronze. Yeah, that would be perfect. Any bronzes? <laughs> All right, Zom. Oh shit! All right, Rand. How bad's your Terran? Okay, I believe that actually. Hey, Dexorcist also. Well, I have Rand on my friends list already, so he wins. <laughs> Come back! <laughs> no, I'm not. I just want to know. <laughs> It's gonna be another TVT though, so. Oh, I hate tanks. <laughs> uh, I could ask him what his Protoss is, but I think his Protoss is actually not bad. Okay, no, then we'll do uh, a. <laughs> I'll suffer tanks. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm -mm. Let's see, what haven't you played yet? Uh, Antigua? I don't think you played that yet. Yeah, that's what I thought, so... <clears throat> uh, d d d d. Okay, ready? Yeah. Uh, okay. People keep asking what league is Llama, and I'm like, he's Masters. <laughs> <laughs> Rand's a nice guy. Ow. So maybe he'll, you know, be a little easy. <laughs> I don't know about easier. <laughs> but I, I, I believe I want to say his Terran's pretty poor. He usually plays Zerg. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now remember, before 12 like minutes, you're pretty damn like good, so... Those medivacs hit, I want you to actually push and try and do something. Okay. Oh, that should have been over one, shouldn't it? Yep. Oh well. <clears throat> oh, I'm watching Rand. <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> Alright, well Rand already has the worst opener, so... Oh, good. Looking pretty good. Uh, SCV first. Yeah, now barracks. Now, okay. Terran's actually a really fun race. I know it might seem really boring doing the same thing right now, but, like, when you get more comfortable and you start learning things, you can start mixing in cheeses to end TVTs faster. You can start not using tanks all the time. It's pretty fun. Oh, that'd be nice. Wouldn't it, though? <laughs> Pretty much only really, really good people bio and, and TVZ though, so yeah, you're just gonna learn how have to learn how to two racks into the game before five minutes. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, this isn't any special edition, so you gotta scout everywhere. Oh yeah, darn it. Uh, Antigua's pretty hacks because uh, in TVT it sucks. Yeah, uh, there's like this ledge right here that's so difficult to overcome. Mm -hmm. So if you can go over to his base and hit that ledge and drop, you're like 
already in a fantastic position. It sucks, but that's how it's played. <laughs> Alright, so... Your scout's not gonna get there for a while, and he's... He's already pretty... walled in. So I'm assuming it's not there. It's not. Actually, you can usually... you can get lucky sometimes, and... they'll... Uh, if your opponent blocked, then your SCV will actually just not go over there, it'll go like someplace else. So that can sometimes help in determining where someone is. <clears throat> oh god! Where your SCV's going? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, yep, come back. It's okay. time for the all in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know what that was. Alright, so you're, you're, you found his base. Oh, At this point, like, your SCV's gonna die, like, it's too far in. Um, oh. but you would want to, in that case, try and get up that ramp and see what he has. Um, generally mm -hmm. you won't see a lot. You already saw his command center, so you know, hey, he's, like, one of expanding. Um, but if you see a tech lab up, tech lab up there, it's, it's well worth it. <clears throat> Unfortunately, you don't know what's going on, so... You will want to scan around, like, six minutes. Pretty much the first scan that your natural brings you, you want to scan. Uh, um, they haven't changed it yet. Chat. Uh, I actually thought they did, so I was playing like five PVPs, PVPs in a row, and three of them were untomed. And three times it was cross position, so I was like, oh, it changed. Like, good job, Blizzard. But then I had a fourth one, and they weren't in cross positions. But maybe they changed it, like, yesterday. I don't know. Oops. That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> Oops. We'll get it right eventually. Uh, so you want to scan right now. Scan his main, see what he's doing. Because if Banshees were on the way, um, they'd be hitting like in like 30 seconds. Alright, so you see two Raxes and a Tech Lab. This tells you uh, that he's just getting faster tanks. Uh, mm -hmm. He's probably going to play a lot more passive. He could try and abuse the ledge with tanks, but his medevac's going to be so late that you could probably overpower him. Um, so I'd bank on him being passive. Now, no one's taking the Zelnaga, so go ahead and send a marine over there. Uh, Zelnaga uh, on this map's pretty good. Where? To the Zelnaga, the little thing in the middle? Yeah. Kay. Get your factory as well, and your stim. <clears throat> and your third gas. Also, that scan told you that he's not going mech, so... It's already a different PVT. That bunker's in an interesting position, but I guess it does its job. Do you just, like, forget to get the third add-on? Because you, like, hmm? you never get it. Oh. The third add-on? I never, um, I didn't do that before. So I just forget to. Oh, okay. Mr. Lama didn't teach me that. Okay. The third add-on in the barracks. We never put one on this one. Yeah, you can if you want. No, I'm saying we never did. No. You never talked. Okay. Uh, call down your mules. I guess that's one thing you haven't been doing a whole lot. Getting your mules. Uh, put your guys in gas. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> and you know he's not going mech right now, so just completely forget about those marauders. Oh, okay. And get your siege check and your siege tanks. And make sure not to get supply blocked. Oh yeah. Uh, another good thing about this, or another point to point out about this map, is this little fog area. You want to put a supply depot or a marine or something over there, because that is where they are going to drop 100% if you're not paying attention. 
<clears throat> and uh, at this point, oh, okay. So after Stam, get combat shields. Um, get your medevac. And then once that pops out, I want you to go ahead and push at him. Okay. But, but we might want to wait ten seconds because. Shoot, that's not what I wanted. Okay, bam. So he's actually coming to you. Mm -hmm. you see that with his El Naga. So forget you know what I said about pushing. Just start siege that tank when siege is done. <gasps> it's it's almost done. He's not gonna be there. And then you're also gonna want some want to put some units up on your top where you just put that supply depot because he's gonna he's probably gonna do what I was talking about. Um, the the lift and contain. Uh, additionally, get your third or your barracks. Uh, since he's pushing, I'll do just barracks. Okay. And get your plus one armor. And also keep making those SCVs. And just go ahead and rally your main to your net. Okay, yeah, you did. Good. Oh, you rallied it to your gas, so there's five guys on gas. Really? <laughs> yeah, you don't want to fix that. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, so. <clears throat> now you don't know where he is because your scouting has been denied pretty much. So you want to send one marine and just send it like right in front of your base. Just to see if he ever moves up. Anything like that, I suppose. And what you'll find out what he's actually doing is he's actually just taking the Zalnaga and then turtling hard um, and uh, macroing pretty hard. Uh, also get your armory and additional engineering bay. And uh, two reactors. And your third. You can go ahead and build the third at your third. Oh, I can build it outside? Yeah. That's out here, yeah. Uh, if you don't feel safe enough to, you build it at your natural, where that big space is. <clears throat> Okay, so your money's like pretty good. Keep building those tanks. It's gonna be very important. Uh, you have coverage of everywhere that he drop or every popular spot that he drop, and your upgrades are on the way. So right now you have no idea what he's doing. The last thing you like knew was that he was at the Zonaga. So go ahead and scan the Zonaga. Make sure he's still there and not like busting down your third rocks. Right. Um, the, in front of the Zonaga, the, the, the air right there. So you're like, okay, he's still there. Uh, you know there's a lack of medevacs, but they're coming. Uh, yeah. So he has that. Like, you're not going to break it unless you have a huge supply lead. Mm -hmm. So at this point, what you want to do is you want to either drop, or if you don't have comfortable enough to do that, you want to just take a group of units with a medevac and just run around the outskirts of that Zalnaga. You can see the vision. No, you can't. But I so can. like this many? Yeah, like that okay. many. And just, like, literally, like, hug the walls of the bases so you can get around the Zalnaga without him seeing it. Uh, and then just go ahead and attack like his third rocks, get up there, um, stuff like that. Because he's, he's got that center, you know, pretty down pat. You want to force him out of position. Uh, and while that's happening, keep making SCVs, keep getting, you know, spotty bows, uh, getting units, get your upgrades, your plus two, plus two. Okay. His upgrades are looking pretty good. Um, your units are actually going to like the I don't know where they're oh, going. Oh, they're not going. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you could you could also just lift. Like, like either one. Oh, Lord. <laughs> You're supposed to be doing something else, not watching. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm making them. Um, yeah, she's good. Yeah. Keep making SCVs, and... Did he see you? No, but he's about to. Alright, so go ahead and, like, snipe... Oh, shit, you didn't see it. Did he see you? Yeah, he saw you. Um... Yeah, you're gonna want to pick up and run away. <laughs> okay. But he just pulled everything back, so this would be your chance to go take that Zalnaga. <laughs> so take all your units and go take that Zalnaga. Snap, okay. snap, snap. He's gonna about to go take it again. But you, you just got the idea of what you're supposed to do. Like, pull him out of position, take his advan his situation, his high ground. Uh, he only took it with marines right now, and you don't have a bigger army, but he just gave it up, so... Oh, this is gonna be tough. Um, you stim and run away. No, stim, stim. Yeah, yeah. No, no. Oh shit. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, he he wasn't actually attacking you, and he didn't see just tanks. So you actually had like the greatest 
attack ever. <laughs> um, but go ahead and seed your tanks. Now you have the position, and now you have to start worrying about him backstabbing you. So I would suggest, you know, getting that orbital command at that third. Keep making SCVs. Uh, oh, he forgot stim. Oh, uh, that's why. <laughs> that's a pretty big boon to you. Um, and and make a turret line uh, in your main. In my main? Yeah, so. Uh, you also have some guys in a medevac. That's great. Drop them where you, where you were attacking. Oh, he didn't kill them? No, he yeah, he... Uh, nice. <laughs> I, I don't know why, but he didn't. Huh. <laughs> <clears throat> Just strapped him. Uh, your 2 is about to finish, so be mindful of getting your 3-3. Three, three. I mean, okay, the fact that he doesn't yeah. have, like, a, a stim is, like, really, really great. I would, like, love for you to be able to push in, but you can't. He has too many tanks. Uh, get your supply depot. I mean... Oh, sorry, not not a... By a turret line in TVT, I mean... The rim of your base? Turrets. Not in your mineral <coughs> line. Oh... Uh... Alright, so he's actually about to drop you pretty hard, so take a lot of your units and go back to your main. Okay. Yeah, he's dropping you real, really hard. Uh, in fact, a turret line wouldn't have stopped that, it just would have helped a little. You, you'll, you'll have to pull back at this point. Uh, yeah, that's that's a good amount. Uh, make sure the medevacs don't go into the marine line, though. Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out! Okay, one went down, not too bad. And yeah, that that should be enough to actually send him away. And he's still oh, the main. <laughs> hmm? Oh, watch your medevax, watch your medevax. Okay, stim those units and attack him. Oh, he's running away, actually. Oh, he's running into you! Oh, lame. Okay, so. Kill a lot of supply depots. At this point, make that turret ring that I was talking about. Build additional factory, build additional barracks, uh, build another command center, start using that money. Hey, you have you oh my god, look at this Onaga. You have that vision. Oh shit. Okay. His medevacs actually went into your vision, so you could have went and sniped them, but he uh he pulled back. So more barracks, more supply depots. Hey, Pyro. Uh keep building SCVs, build another command center. Okay, you see. Okay, get ready to stim because his army's coming. Nope, never mind. But you see his army moving. No, you don't. Never mind. No, I don't. Okay, no, but I it's see moving. something on the edge. Okay, so you see it moving a little bit on the edge. So he's going around. Exactly. Right? So once you identify that, move some of your army to intercept him, to like to left the Zanaga. You don't want him to get access to your third uh, rocks. Pretty much, that's what he's gonna try and do. Okay, gotta back up. Once he sees yeah. you, back up. <laughs> But Ooh. he just left his open, so, like... You just leave your tank sieged. <laughs> yeah, take some of your tanks. Um, you see that, like, the tanks that are your natural? Oh, fuck, he's about to drop you really bad. Okay, so... I'm not making enough stuff. Anything at your natural and your main, send... Can I have three barracks? Oh my god, go attack him. Go attack him. Um, okay. Okay, he's uh, inside your main, he's... Should I, wait, oh, back mine? Crap, it's kind of too late right now. <laughs> Alright, go attack him, because he's, he's got a chokehold on you. Go attack, no, his base, his base, not oh. him. Yeah, his base. And just rally everything that you can to your natural. Like tanks, marines, everything to your natural. You're going to go into a base race, pretty much. Unfortunately, like, you, if you caught him beforehand, you could have just stopped all of this, but, you know, it wasn't to be. So... <clears throat> He's actually max, he actually doesn't have anything to build in his main, so you kind of have the advantage right there. Oh, you don't have any tanks to build, though. Oh, that's a problem. Okay. <laughs> Lift everything and <laughs> run away. <laughs> Just exactly like he's doing. <laughs> This is kind of the name of the game in TVT is outmaneuvering and stuff like that, so he just simply outmaneuvered you. <clears throat> uh, just destroy everything that you can. Okay. He's probably gonna win because eventually you're gonna have to like head e hit each other head on. He is losing Metavax though, that's nice. Trying to overstim. 
you're, you're taxing your medivacs, so... You can kill all this, obviously, without stim. Stop stimming so much! Oops. Push Unfortunately, up. he killed, like, a lot of everything. Oh, darn. <laughs> Uh, I mean, you still have a chance. The supply gap is actually not that bad. Oh, I've got one. Got it. Go land your command center, then drop mules and repair with them. Yeah. You actually have a bigger army supply than him. The key, though, right now is to get his tanks unseaged. If you can do that, you yeah, might right, be able to mules. win. Mm -hmm. Oh god! Oh, no, no, no. And repair, and repair, repair. repair. Okay. Oh shit. Ooh. Nice. Go protect that siege tank that's in the Zalnaga. Like, oh shit, he knows where you are. He's caught on to you. No. You're probably gonna have to lift that command center again and just send it back to your main. Like, I advise doing it now. And just send it back to your All main. Right. Now lift it off and float it straight. <laughs> into the black, into the black. So. <laughs> So, um, right now, you oh, know yeah. that he has a command center. He hasn't been revealed. Mm -hmm. uh, so you, your job is to like kind of figure out where that is, and also find his other production facilities. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> or you can actually take a fight. If you see him unseaged, yeah. that would be fantastic. Um, it probably won't happen if he plays a smart, though, so you're going to have to just focus on rebuilding. Uh, so <laughs> land your command center somewhere. And and take like five marines and send them every which way to try and find those. Stay here. Uh, it's no, it's kind of hard to say. Um, well, I'll just send a few. Yeah, just send them every which way. You want to find those production facilities that he lifted. Uh, it's a really difficult situation right now. <laughs> uh, he's gonna have a better economy. Um, oh shit! Never mind. Okay, this is <laughs> this is really interesting. Alright, so he is supply blocked right now, and he only has one SCV. <laughs> <laughs> so, I have one SCV. So. Well, you're also supply blocked, but like, the economies actually are the same right now. Because <laughs> he can't build anything. Um, so that's great. Oh, take out those Vikings if you can. That's really important. Those Vikings that are just going to fly over it, it's not even going to be that difficult. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> um, that, was, that was a really big boon, actually, because in the late game... Terran's lifting everywhere scenario, Vikings are important, and now he doesn't have any. Uh, he's also giving you a really good uh, <laughs> chance. He just showed where all of his uh, buildings are by floating them over your command center. Yeah. So. Wait, I mean, so I lift it and move it? No, no. Yeah, yeah, now you have to move it because he sees you. But your army, like, if you can go attack it and just. Okay, oh, right, so just take all my crap. stuff and go. <clears throat> If you can catch him unseaged, then you have a chance. Like, like okay, go now. Go tag those tanks. Back. Go tag those tanks. Crap, he might be too far. Oh, it's, it's gonna be so close. <laughs> what I want you Where to do is, is literally get the tanks and yeah. run away. Okay. So if he doesn't see. Oh god. Okay, stim, stim, stim. Watch your medivacs. Watch your medivacs. Kill the tanks. Kill the tanks. Run away. Yeah, run away. <laughs> oh no, you all saw your medevacs. That actually went really poorly. Die too. Oh, Jesus Christ. Damn, <laughs> that, was your, that was your one chance. Remember what we said about medevacs <laughs> and not going for it? Whoops. You threw them away again. That's, that was pretty good though. Oh! Oh, oh wait, yeah. okay, go attack. Oh. Go attack his base. <laughs> Where's his base? Oh, sorry. Um, Go ahead where you were going. Where your command center's going, go there. There's gonna be... Oh. Uh, I don't know if you can take on three tanks. You're gonna have to spread, but I don't know if you know how. Stim and attack those. Stim and attack them. <laughs> I mean, it's not gonna win you the game, but you can get a. Tr you can get a. What's it called? A. Uh... Shit. Oh, there's another tank. No. No, oh, I'm dead. Oh, okay. No, I'm dead. That was. Oh, that was so close. <laughs> <laughs> I'm full on dead. Oh my God. <laughs> he has one supply. I have one command center left. That is all I have. <laughs> you have one marine, bro. <laughs> like. Oh, I do? Yeah. <laughs> He's below the no. Sanaga. No, they're all dead. <laughs> I'm just gonna. Ah, <laughs> you were actually defeated.
Yeah. That was so close, though. Ah, lame. Making I've seen in a long time. <sighs> what did you say? That was the worst decision making I've seen in a long time. <laughs> and unit micro. Yeah. 